So I learned from an older toaster I took apart that they put the element together or they connected the element with a mechanical connection. This is the connection they had. So I'm going to do a similar connection with stainless steel just like they have here. Mine's a little longer. It's about a 0.5 resistance. Well, it don't look like much, but these element connecting bars made out of stainless steel drilled and tapped all cut by hand represents about 10 hours i'd say two to three hours a piece just some miscellaneous materials toaster element toaster element fiberglass that i'm going to cut pieces out of if all, if all goes well Toaster element fiberglass pieces I'm cutting for the cement molds. Element side plate. There's the outside. And here's the inside. Sand battery refrigerator element side plate. This represents days of work here. side plate with the cement ready for cement got a brace at the top and this is going to be all insulated I'll put a little roof up top so it don't ever get rain on it again especially if this works if it don't work I'm going to kick it